Hello, this is a review for Pomegranate Lemonade. I got this candle from Bath & Body Works last week. It has a beautiful label. It's a white barn label. And I'm really enjoying it so far. This candle burns 25 to 45 hours. It's a 14 and a half ounce um, jar of wax in the three wick, of course. And I never really trim these wicks because especially as I have heard over the years, the reviews, sometimes they can get very, very shallow wicks as the candle burns down. And so they almost want to drown in the wax. And I'm figuring unless I'm seeing any kind of um, sooting issues or black billowing smoke or whatever, I am probably not going to be trimming these wicks so that when the candle um, burns down, it'll still have a fair amount of wick left. And I haven't had too much of a problem with that. I wanted to go ahead and share this because I feel like I've really got a good feel for the scent. Even though it's only burned down to where it is, um, I wasn't sure I was going to like this at first. Generally speaking, I do love lemon scents and all kinds of citrus fragrances. Pomegranate lemonade just jumped out at me. I love pomegranates. I remember being a kid and getting a pomegranate now and then at the grocery store. My mom would get one and um, they're pretty good. They're kind of annoying to eat, but they're kind of fun to have in the summertime. And uh, growing up with a lemon tree, I just love lemons to this day and all kinds of citrus. So this seemed like a sure bet for me. It's a very tart smelling candle on cold. Upon burning, it smells pretty much the same. I had heard someone reference this candle and say that it could sometimes smell like a citronella scent to them. And to me, I was hoping it didn't do that because I don't always like the smell of a citronella candle. In fact, I just normally don't. I can appreciate it outdoors though if you're having um, some activities and you're trying to repel mosquitoes with that. but. I was hoping that this didn't smell like a mosquito repellent <laughs> candle. And anyway, it doesn't to me, um, although it almost did. It almost still does, but it does not. I get the tart lemonade. I get the strong uh, pomegranate lemonade combination there. I don't want to lift this up and read it off the bottom, but the, the fragrance description by Bath & Body Works is something along the lines of this. It basically is saying to imagine an ice cold glass of lemon juice, pomegranate nectar with a touch of sugar. And it's a really good description because um, notice it didn't say lemonade, it's a lemon juice in the description and pomegranate nectar. So it is lemon juice compared to lemonade is just pretty tart. A touch of sugar is just about right in this because you don't really smell it. It's not a lot of sugar, but I can't imagine it without the touch of sugar. It would be even more tart, perhaps. So as far as this camel goes, the, the color is just gorgeous. I think this is beautiful. It's kind of um, almost really girly because of the hot, hot pink color, but not necessarily, not necessarily at all. Um, it's pretty. It would be a great candle to repurpose the glass afterward because you could just remove that label and have a plain container. In other words, the label's not etched into the side or anything, and you could just use it for all kinds of things. So it's rather green in that way. So I am glad I got this. I got this for a little over $6. I feel like it's a great way to try this candle. I know it's been out in other labels. Uh, they were selling this with some strawberry cupcake candles, and there weren't as many of these as there were of the strawberry cupcake left. There was like a couple of these and maybe a few of the strawberry cupcake and I grabbed a couple of those too. And I was just really hesitant on both because um, I wasn't sure what to expect. For some reason, a little more so than, um, I'm not so nervous about trying out all the fall scents. So anyway, I wanna thank you for watching my video today um, and I will have more to come. If you're interested, please feel free to subscribe so you don't miss any videos. I just enjoy talking about candles and reviewing them. Um, I'll, I do purchases and share those on here and all kinds of things, including the empties videos on occasion. Although I'm kind of different in that regard because I don't 
wait till the end of a month necessarily. I just do an empties review or empties video when I get a full bag or feel like it would be enough to fill up a video. So I hope you have a wonderful day. Thanks for watching. Bye.